Hi everyone, my name is Robert, and I just want to tell you a little bit about myself and my life. <clears throat> when I was growing up and at school and that, I was bullied. I didn't like it. Everyone liked to tease me, pick on me. My brother was always there for me, back in my school days, and so was he. We went to the same school. I was small, skinny, and that. But it wasn't fun. He'd always look after me. Even his mates. And all his mates know me well. It was very sad. Moving out of home was boring. In 2009, moving to Auckland, away from my brother, my dad, all my fam my cousins and that, anyone else, was sad. Flying to Auckland for my scoliosis back in 2002, it was very cool to see my grandparents and my cousin, cousins and my, my auntie and that. But, you know, going for my surgery took 12 hours. A guy from America did it. It was very cool. Having no TV for a whole 12 hours up there. Blew out. It was sad. Had to make fun. And, you know, short thing was, I had fun. And that, see my grandmother, my, aunt, my nana, my nanny and that, it was really cool. Having fun. But when she got very sick, we were in the same hospital, but different area. She was in one ward, I was in the other. I don't think I'd be standing today. I'd have been in a wheelchair. My brother still would have got jealous. Me getting favouritism and all that. He still would have got it. And, yeah. In 2005, being in Auckland, came. I got to do, while I was in Auckland, I got to do a lot of things. <clears throat> go watch cars, go drift, watch drifting, do lots of things. Go beaches, do bush walks, meet some friends. Meet an African guy, yes, named Zaidu. Yes, he's very cool. Top quality, good drummer. Taught me a few skills. Very good. But very sneaky at the same time. Doesn't remember where he puts things. He is a character, you know. He still wants my grandmother's leg. Yeah. Well, pardon me. Back living in Wall moved to Wellington in <clears throat> 2015. My brother and my sister got married. It was very cool. And that, got a niece now, <clears throat> named Maddie. <clears throat> but, you know, since my brother had an injury, it's a little bit different in that he forgets a lot of things, just like I forget things. Seeing my dad a lot is very annoying, because he doesn't understand my needs. I've got a disability. He likes to pick on me a lot, and it's very, very sad because he doesn't understand me properly. I have ideas for things, he just doesn't want to do them. Every time I do something, nah, nah, nah. So, there you go. And I love to talk as well. Jojo, I could beat you at a talking competition. I could go the whole day, from morning the day I get up, the day I go to bed, I'll beat you. I can go 24-7. I could beat you in a talking competition. I would. And yes, I love to dance. I'm not fashion at it. And I love fishing. Yes, every year, my dad enters my brother, me, and him in it. We take my sister. And my niece, we take the motorbike, the dogs, we've got three dogs, we pack up a tent, we camp gear, we go. And 
Yeah, money is a problem for me. People don't understand. I want to save, save for a goal. And I know you've got a goal. You're already living your goal, your dream. I want to live my dream. So if I can meet you, Jojo, in New Zealand, you just have to get on Instagram and message me on Instagram. I'll let you know the details, where I am, and that, and the time difference. If you're out there, want to meet me, and that's your video I saw, inspired me to get this video of mine done. So, I watched it. And your brother pranking you? Whoo! That was good! I've done a few of those myself. The old toothpaste on the door handle. Yep, done that one. Done that. Done that one. Mum's, my mum's done it too. The old clamp on the tyre. Parked in the parking lot. Meant to be parked, but it was funny. Yes, there's two of them we've done. Doing a flat, having the same with a flat type we haven't done that one too. That's the next one I pranked. Yes. If you ever want to give fishing a go, you catch a decent sized fish. In February, the 24th and 25th, Jojo, is a fishing competition in Wanganui in New Zealand. If you want to come down to that, it's at South Beach, the, where the airport is. Now, you'll find it. You'll find you'll find it. It's early riser to late at night drinking. If you don't like drinking, take grab a chili bin and go. You could even donate the chili bin to someone else and sign it. Donate it to someone who needs it. Because there's always motels there you can stay in. Just book it before you come. And yeah. I'd love to meet you in New Zealand. And that would be really awesome. Because, yeah. So, i got to go. See you later. And bye.